Hello and welcome to Trade of the Week on Monday, the 18th of September. A few weeks ago, we went uh, long tallow oil and uh, then unfortunately, the company uh, trimmed its output uh, forecast. And um, basically, that led to the share price dropping by about 10%. But as you can see here, we didn't get stopped out. Our stop loss was below the last reaction low at 31 pence and 50. Uh, and this time around, basically what happened, we bounced off the uh, long term uptrend and also the red line here, the 200 day simple moving average at 32 and a half pence. So we're still long uh, tallow oil with regards to that trade. And uh, what we can do is perhaps uh, raise our stop loss if you wanted to to, to the last um, reaction low, uh, just below 32.50, or you can leave it where it is. Um, then last week we went long uh, dollar yen and did so at around 147.35. Uh, so far you are in profit on this trade. So what you can do is if you want to, so you raise your uh, stop loss level to break even, uh, thereby reducing the, your risk to about zero and just letting it run. Or you can cash in your profits now uh, or um, just, just let the position run as it is. So that's another one which is still open, which brings me then to this week's trade of the week. And uh, it is to go short the DAX 40 contract. And the reason for this is that uh, basically uh, we are now on a time frame, uh, the last two weeks of September, where traditionally equity markets quite often have a negative phase and tend, tend to um, have increased volatility and tend to decline into October. And also from a technical perspective, we've just failed again to break through the orange line here, the 55 day simply moving average and didn't last week manage to break above the late August high at 16,044. And as you can see here, we had this um, tiny uh, candlestick formation, which we are falling through now today, which is telling me that perhaps we are heading back down again ahead of this week's FOMC meeting, Bank of England rate decision, and also Bank of Japan rate decision, and also inflation data coming out of the Eurozone and the United Kingdom. So for all of these reasons, and also the technical reason here, I would like to go short the DAX 40 contract with a stop loss above the August high at 16,045 and a downside target of at least 15,500, maybe even lower. So this week's trade of the week is to go short the DAX 40, ideally on a bounce back towards 18,000, um, excuse me, towards uh, 15,845 uh, with a stop loss at uh, 16,045 and a downside target of around 15,500 or 15,400. <laughs>